Yeah, good day, McDaddy. Where are we today, mate? Yeah, we're in Adelaide, mate. Um, we've had some viewers just quiz us about the Island Star caravans. Yep. So we thought we'd come over to uh, Noel's caravans and yep. have a look at some of the uh, bands they've got on offer. Yep. So yeah, we might just have a quick look and see what's what is on offer. Cool. All right, let's get into it. Yeah. I'm Naomi, I'm Noel's daughter. Um, we're a family business that's been going since 1974. Dad's caravan since he was a kid back in the 50s and I've caravan since I was a baby. We sell our own new band, Island Star Range, as well as the Seascape. And the Island Star Range started back in 1983 um, and we do custom build to suit you. All sorts of options. You can right. have inverters, you can have different size fridges, compressor yep. fridges, different layouts. There's probably about 30 different layouts out oh, wow. there. So the new section of the yard where you started it before, yep. um, there's probably about 30, 35 bands okay. on display. All different little layouts, different tweaks to them, so yeah. Great. So this is an Island Star. Island Star Extreme X. Yeah. We've got a slider fridge area here. Yep. That's right at the front of the van. Spots. Yeah. Yep. Oh, big area for storage. Wow, size of that area. There's your uh, stabilizer legs. Yep. That's a really big area, isn't it? It is. Let's pull them up there and have a look, Dan. What's that? Yeah, it's full width of the van. Holy cow. We've got some more right compliance there. plates on the side. What's that say there? Oh, thanks. A GTM of 3030. Yep. With an ATM of 3190. Still. Sorry about the windy today, uh, viewers. It's an awful day here in Adelaide, but uh, we take them as we can get them. Yep. Roll out awning there. Roll out awning. Car, yeah. All right. Do you want to go around the outside first and have a bit of a look what it looks yeah, like have underneath? A and the yep. Once again, you have to excuse the wind here, but reversing camera lights. Yeah. Spare wheel on the back here. What's the suspension no. like underneath it? You've got a plastic water tank under there, a single, yep, single, single water tank. tank. So this, is, this might be semi-off-road, is it? It's dual axle, yeah, mainly on the line, that's fine. There's another. What have we got here? Another storage area? Yeah. Oh, this is the back of the toilet. Yep. Okay. Yeah, that's your toilet. Thing to next to the outside. Good. Yeah. Nice connection there. Well, this is where the bridge is behind here somewhere. Yeah. Another drain pipe coming out. Yep, that's the other side. It's a long way through, isn't it? Big storage. Yeah, plenty of storage on the stuff. Yeah. Big frame on it. Let's have a quick look inside, mate. Yep. By the Caravan Industry Association of Australia. So, yep. That's a good ticket, isn't it? Yep. Australian right. made and owned. It's quite a nice uh, tour of the area. Wow. Yep, and a washing machine as well. Oh, it's a good size shower, isn't it? Local family business established in 1974. Right. Custom built, deals with retro factories. Yep. A workshop on a premises where each fan receives a 40 point check prior to leaving. Wow. Nice. 
So this is gas electric one. This is a swift one, but this would be one of the new ones. Um, it's a gas electric. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay, and we got uh, two forty N twelve volt across here as well. What's what's the other one you've just noticed now, McDaddy? Was it the extreme off road or something or? Yeah, it's this dirt road one. Where's that? Just over here. It's another big. Quite oh big wow! Thing. Check this out. Yep. But you notice she's got the double shocks plus small coils on each. Hang on. Let's have a look at the shocks. Yep. Look at that. I don't know if you can see that there. Let's go right underneath here. Look at that for suspension. It's got there the coils, double shocks. Good setup there. I think we can get a better view from the back of it here, McDaddy. Let's have a look at the back. Those dual wheels there. Let's have a look under here. So that gives you a really good idea of it there. Uh, well, this one here might be a grey water one. I'd imagine it's a grey water. So you have a grey yeah. water plus you'd have your glitz purple tank. Yes, yeah, so this has got the same sort of compartments as the other one. Yeah. Once again, excuse the noise. We're right by um, peak hour at this time, so. This is a diesel thing. These oh, vans are fitted with, with uh, diesel heaters. Oh, so it's got the diesel tank just here. Diesel tank there for the heater inside. Yep. And there's two like um, openers. Yep. There's a little slide up one there, and the other side of NASA's got a bigger slide up one. Right, let's have a bit of a look at that. Yep. Okay. This has got some... Such, uh, yeah, gas bottles in there. Two gas on us, okay. Oh, a switchable valve. Switch, so that'd be something I'd like to do to ours instead of having to just have the, the one and plug it in and plug it up you know, the other side. I think it's. Uh, yeah, so plus a two, two junction and. Yeah. Just lift him up for a second. And at least they seal uh, properly by looking at it too. So let's take another view of that that uh, that tank there. You can see it's got the pipe running through inside. This is the other one. Right? That's a bigger slide. Oh yeah, it's a good size one, isn't it? Yep. Very similar. Okay, what's the... Before we go much further, what's the price of this one at the moment? Oh, this one's, this is getting up, 109. Yeah. That's as listed here, so 94 base price, 94.9, so I call it 95. Yep. Yeah. Oh, a nice little window there. Yeah. Mix the taps. Yeah, so that's pretty much the same as the other one, really, apart from that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, for those people into caravans, it's quite a nice looking band. Quite nice and fitted up. Yeah. Oh look, this is a nice little got little hat rack and stuff, isn't that a nice little yeah. little touch there? Good size freezer as well. Yeah. Nice for add the tools and the uh, at the right height. Oh yeah. Okay. Sliding door. I think the same as the other one, isn't it? Yeah. All very much the same fittings. Yeah. Rear air columns. Yeah. There was one back here. Like, they fall off road. Yeah. Excuse the windy. This one here is the concert panel one. The panel stuff comes from Germany. Right. Just to make it lighter, I think, though, really, isn't it? It's just like in the kilo light. difference between this and the other one inside the one like, like we've got there. 
What was so, that? 80 kilos, was it? 80 kilos difference in weight yep. between the composite panel and the aluminium over here. Cool. So these are these bands are just over 21 foot or 21.6. Yep. So well, 80 uh, 80 kilos. That's uh, 80 kilos of food, mate. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay, we'll go with that. <laughs> Give a take for nine feet. All right, I think most of these are pretty much the same. We might just go and have a look, see if there's anything slightly different, McDaddy. And then what That's I'd like right. to do is have a look at some of these second-hand ones to just give people a bit of an idea of how these things travel after a few years. What do you reckon? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Um, it seems quite good here. Like I say, they've made their off-road campus fully off-road, so you can go off the beaten track, uh, off grid, with some of the other ones you wouldn't. And uh, yeah. I, I think we were saying a bit earlier too is that uh, I'm not going to say good or bad about particular brands. However, um, in, in saying about prices, we're looking about uh, seventy to say hundred thousand dollars for this fully set up. I think the, these seem to be a little bit better value for money. It would be fair. Yeah. Um, uh, horses for horses. That's right. But there seems to be more features in these, like um, diesel heaters. Yeah. It seems to be a better quality fit. Um, well, let's let's have a look at that. Um, now we yeah. did this with and the DA35. The DA35s. Whereas yep. um, in another manufacturer we looked at, it was nearly all the standard 50 mil tarball. Yeah, that's 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 right. Yep. Well, let's let's the test out that first. Is, so, pretty good. right. So let's just look at the fitting. So here we've got good quality, good quality awning. Yep. The. So you've got the grey waste tank installed. Yep, grey waste tank. Okay, we'll do a similar thing we did the other day. Let's look under the seats and see what the uh, quality of the fittings are underneath. This is a, quite a nice finished seat as well. So, it's, that's, that's well secured in there. That's, secure, that's secured. So that's not going to move. No. So you've actually got... Oh, right. So you've got proper drawers and slide outs and things like that there. It's a material top. Yep. Yeah. But no, this is a very strong, secure fit. And, and look at this down here. In. Look at this down underneath that. We've got a little fitting there. Yeah. But just look at this table. See how it's all hinged as well. Yeah. Yeah. So this. Ah, oh, right. So the whole table folds back out as you. Okay. Yeah. Yep. That's a beautiful looking table as well. Yeah. That's quite a solid table. Whereas other vans that we've looked at have been very, mm. very flimsy. Point and range. the cupboards are all good quality as well as we were saying before. Yep. Yeah, that's that is well finished. I'm, oh, come on, that's on me up. Yeah, that's, <laughs> yeah, that's it's very latches. Good. Look at the latches are very solid, so that's not coming open. So if you look at this latch here that I'm looking at now, that is positive locked. Yep, and it is well well disguised as a as a positive lock cupboard as well. Uh, stereo up the top here. We've also got some really nice little pointed uh, little lamps here which really complement the fit as well. Uh, yeah. The drawers, what have we got included in the drawers here? So we've got... Yeah, that's just a nice deep oh, drawer. Oh, look at the size of it. Yeah, so that's that's quite a deep drawer, that. Yep, and that's... Solid. Pretty solid, yep. That's a nice little touch, isn't it? Yeah. I like the uh, the vents in the roof, too. Yeah, well lit. Yeah, well lit, isn't it? Speakers anywhere. Another shiny thing. What's the mattress like? Yeah, I see. Is it? That's a decent mattress. Yeah. Mattress uh, topper on the nice. side. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shiny thing again, McDaddy. So. Oh, I love shiny things. Yeah. So, uh, I think walking around, they're all pretty much the same pointed inside. Yeah. Uh, it seems to be the same quality of finish. We like what we see. I think you'd agree. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like myself. I'll just take one of these with me. So. Just chuck in the comments if there's any opinions, negative or positive, about what we've got to say. Yeah, shiny thing still. Shiny thing again. Will you stop touching stuff? <laughs> Get out! <laughs> <laughs> Get out.